Welcome back guys to a brand new video and we are finally playing gun game I've been talking about this new game mode for so long and I'm so glad it's finally here update 0.9.6 just dropped today I think earlier this morning it took a while for it to come to iOS so I'm kind of a tad bit late but it doesn't matter because we finally have it now and if you don't know the way gun game works is you basically have a set of guns and every time you kill a gun, you, I mean, every time you kill a player, you move on to the next gun. So as you keep doing that, you eventually get to the knife. And once you get the knife kill, you win. Now, there are 15 guns to get through. It's the same set of guns every time. And I really do like this game mode. It's very fun. It has a little twist to, you know, the Borno Diffuse and TDM that we've had for a very long time. And it definitely does spice up the game. Now, this update did have a lot more stuff. I mean, they dropped some new cases. They um, they also added headshots back. I mean, I do really love this update. Now, they have a few problems at rank, though, in my opinion. First of all, I'm not a big fan of you only having to um kill one player to move on to the next gun. I much prefer the way it works in CS because we have to kill two players with that gun before you move on to the next weapon. It just makes the game take you know a little bit longer, and to me, makes it a lot more interesting. Now, I get that it's a mobile game, and I guess it's probably wanted to do that. You know, they want to make the games a lot more shorter. And these games can go by fast. I mean, come on, 15 kills? I've had TDMs where I've gotten, like, 60 kills before, so... I, I'm going to probably end up probably starting seeing a lot of YouTubers, you know, trying to get, like, gun games in less than one minute. Like, I can I can already see the crazy speed challenges for this game mode, because you can go by this really fast if you're really good. But, you know, guys, I am nowhere close enough. I might even try to, you know, do some challenges with this game mode. Maybe try to get a, game, a gun game in less than one minute to finish it, or maybe even, I don't know... Maybe go Falls, that should be pretty fun. But this is definitely a really fun game mode. This opens up a whole new possibility in terms of, you know, challenges you can possibly do. And one thing I'm glad they have is the knife um, for this gun game. So, when you knife somebody, you get to move up a level and they move back level. It's the funnest thing to do, like, watch this guy, get this guy. There you go, Morty on to the next gun. So I get the other guy. Oh, I think somebody else killed him, man. I got backstabbed. But yeah, so knife people makes them go down and it makes you go up a level. It's definitely really fun to do. I think I just really like this game mode. I mean, it's just one of my favorite games. Like, you know, guys, I love using different weapons. If you ever used to watch my TDM videos, I always try to use weapons that nobody else uses. That was a lucky headshot right there, but I always try to use weapons that nobody else uses. And playing this game mode is like just doing that. Game mode literally just made for using tons of different weapons and having skill and guns that people normally don't use, like the M14, the Super 90. Can I get this guy? The XD. Who the hell uses this? Let me knife this guy. Just to make him go down. Oh, shoot. That guy's right there. Let's go ahead and chill in here. Oh, I'm on a knife. I was on the knife. I didn't realize it. I don't like the scoreboard too much, though. It's nice that it shows you on um, what level people are on, and it shows you what gun people are on, but I would still much rather see people's KDs and see their pings and stuff. Maybe we have a toggle to switch that. I don't know. Maybe be able to try to fit them both in. I swear, if I get stuck on a knife, I'm screwed. I'm so scared. I might play two games or good. This is so short. I don't want to get stuck on a knife, man. Knife tends to be the easiest, though. It really does. I mean, I got like what two knives this game? There's a guy right here. There's a guy right here. Oh shoot, he has the X. Oh come on! <laughs> I got like what? I think I got two knife kills, and th the one time I need knife somebody, I get shooted over. And you can see that guy up there is catching up. It does show who's in first place, and then it shows where you are. But because I am in first place, it just shows second place. Taking damage. Can we get this guy? There he is. Come on, come on, come on. Do not kill him. Oh come on! Why did this dude kill him? I swear, if he gets stuck on the knife. Oh my gosh, this guy catches up to my level. It's me against him. I swear, if I lose, it's because of the knife. Come on, spawn me and spawn me. What's taking so long? Right there, right there. Come on. No, no, no. Yes! Oh, assist! What? How was that an assist? I don't get it. I don't get it. How was that an assist? No. Yes! Let's go! I knifed him in midair. He had like an AK or something. <laughs> Shake my head. I don't know how I got stuck on a knife like that, but that was pretty fun. There were three people left. Let's try to play one more game because, yeah, that was only like, what, three minutes? These things go by so fast. There's a warm-up for this game mode, too, which is pretty interesting. I mean, I don't think you need a warm-up for a gun game. It's not, like, competitive or anything. I mean, it's a competitive game mode, but you know what I mean. It's not, like, ranked or anything. But you don't actually get to switch weapons. I'm, I'm curious why you started on the UM, the MP5. Everybody was thinking it was going to start on the um P250 or something, but I guess not. This is really fun, though. It's so fast-paced, too. It is on every map, though, but I think Fury, it might be my favorite map for it to be on. Okay, hopefully we can do a lot better that game. We got stuck on a knife, man. That really sucked. Let's try to push. I really want to try to go for a fall game. I doubt I'll get it this quick. It's probably going to take me a couple weeks, you know, get it. But I really want to fall this game. 
Just that you take a lot of damage using these um, SMGs because SMGs have much longer gun fights instead of um, assault rifles. So you tend to take a lot more damage. I see still. I'm making sure they're not in that little invincible mode. No, he was in our flank. We got pretty far though. That was four and one. Come on, phone me back. Can we get a game under one minute? Okay, I keep pressing the um, control set. I don't know why I keep been doing that recently. I really don't. Just jump down here. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna do a lot of challenges in this game. Maybe do a knife only? That would be crazy, because you can't only knife and you still level up. Yeah, there's just so many challenges you can do now with this new game mode. I really do enjoy it. I really do. And let me know what you guys think. Are you guys really excited for it? I know a lot of people don't have it. If you are on Android, you can sign up for the beta and get it. But for you iOS players, the beta is sadly closed. It's probably going to come out in the next week or so. I mean, I don't see that many bugs in this game. But besides um, the scoreboard, I think I should pick that up a little bit. To me, it just seems a little too big. Especially when the game ends and like half the people aren't on the screen. It's a little weird. Okay, we got to do better. Both is going to beat us. We're not going to let that happen. Got to do better. A little pre fire Look how much damage I took. Cause you know I'm so used to using like AKs and snipers. You use different weapons that kill a lot slower. You can't get those immediate kills. These are some good players too, because all these are beta players. And generally, if you sign up, if you're signing up for betas, you should be at least a decent player. Well, we gotta do better. Just chill up here a little bit. HK. Oh, this is my favorite weapon. No, that dude with the M4. We are not doing good for the second game at all. We gotta we gotta try a little bit harder. Come on, let's get this M4. I mean, this HK. There we go. Aw, oh, Sniper. Let's go. Should be the easiest kill in the world. So are they over there? Nah. Whoa, no. I was the Invincible. <laughs> I really hate that crap. Come on, spawn me back. Spawn me back. I'm not letting this guy beat me. No. Oh, my gosh. Why are they in our spawn? And I was invincible, so that could have been an easy kill for me. I could have just probably sat there and knifed him. Come on, come on, spawn me back. There we go. Come on, we're coming back, we're coming back. We're not letting this, we're not taking an L. I wanted to knife him because he was top. He would have got down a level. Come on. Where did this guy go? Knife, knife. And hear more footsteps. Oh shoot, he was I hate, I hate how enemies can go inside of you. It makes no sense. They should fix that, honestly. It's, it's dumb. Let's keep going though. We need to win this. Come on. We're actually, we're actually catching up. Oh, he's on knife. He's on the knife thing. I just have to hope my teammates don't get knife. Two people are on the knife. Okay. We're not winning this. There's no way we can catch up. I want to get knife. Gotta watch my back. Don't. Oh. Oh, dang. Wait. Oh, I just watched him knife somebody as he stole my kill. Dang. But anyway, guys, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. I will be covering tons of more stuff with this update, so stay tuned. And if you really enjoy, subscribe. Peace, guys.